I love Nick Diaz. You cannot be a fight fan. You cannot be a fight fan and not love Nick Diaz. He comes to fight. He comes with his hands up. He, he never takes a back step. Connor did a great job. He did a great job. He, 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 that, that's what you're supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? And then no one on the whole stage say shit. Wow. What a fight. They left it all inside the octagon. What a fight. Great fight, brother. Great fight. You're the little Mexico Mario. You're the Mexico Mario. Nate Diaz was in there. I, I, I would have likened that one. They were telling me that Aldo will be able to fight in seven weeks' time. So I was like, okay, I'll fight him in seven weeks' time then. But I don't want to cut to 145 pounds for a non-title fight. So let's do a 155 pound fight. Then you look at the 155 pound roster. Who's game to step up and fight? Who brings it? Nate, Nate brings it. The Diaz brothers bring it. They show up to fight. For Nick Diaz and Conor McGregor, uh, Nick, what do you think of Conor's fighting style? And then Conor, the same question about Nick. I like it. <laughs> I like it too. They both lost to Conor McGregor, so they're not entertaining anymore. It's like, you lost it, killed it for me. If I'm a fan, you killed it for me. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, bitch, and then you're just going to be a bitch. And now they're stepping up. Fuck Conor McGregor. It's like, why? Because he did a good job and punked you out. You guys should have stepped up. He did what he was supposed to do. When he stepped in a few times, I threw some elbows as well. I tell you what, man, his face was open up and he's still just coming. He's still just coming at me. You've got to respect that. You've got to respect Nate and, and, and the style of fighting that he brings. Um, how can you not? Hey, and right on, Conor McGregor, for uh, taking the fight. Two on short notice, and we got it done. Nate Diaz, thank you for being awesome. As awesome as ever. I think McGregor put a lot more time into it and understanding, and he was a lot more in tune with his understanding, where, where Eddie Alvarez is kind of just, you know, thinks he's a winner and wants to believe that. Yeah. McGregor knows why he's a winner and know why he believes that. What do you want to see? You want to see me fight and you want to see Conor fight? He's the biggest draw, I'm the biggest draw. He comes in there to fight, you know what I'm saying? He yeah. does, he comes forward, he tries to take you out, and he tries to knock you out, he tries to spin and kick you, he tries to do all this shit, and he's fucking got moves, and he's martial arts, he's trying to improve his, 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 his craft right now, he's trying to get better. It's a hell of a fight, he's a hell of a competitor, bro, the best in me. Hey, good job today, Connor, but we going for three, for real.